Hey, I'm Freiberger from Hot Rod. You know what? Today, it occurred to us that we need to figure out who has the most bitchin' beater in America. You know why? Because in our opinion, it's that car right there. The Derelict, a 52 Chrysler wagon with a DeSoto front clip. And I gotta tell you, this thing rides and drives so smooth that we need you to prove that you've got a better beater. Sign up at facebook.com forward slash hot rod mag and post a picture of your beater that is better than this one. But right now, let's go find out what makes this thing so great. That's DeSoto the Explorer right there. His face actually lights up on this car. But here is the meat of it all. Even though this thing looks like a complete pile, it is stuffed with modern drivetrain. That is an SRT8 6.1 liter Hemi, and it is backed with a factory five-speed automatic transmission. All the cooling you could ever want, air conditioning, the whole shebang. All that hardware is really cool, but it really doesn't matter unless the car itself has character. And the thing about beaters and about patina is that it has to be the right patina. It can't just be Junkie Joe dirt, it has to have the wonderful burnish of age and the cool style that they put into cars in the 50s that you just don't see anymore. Right down to like the hinges. Check this thing out. That could be on a refrigerator door of bank vault or something. The real genius of it is that it looks clapped out on the outside, but the interior is money. This is actually original upholstery on original seats. It's almost completely stock, except for the fact that all the amenities are here. And do you notice how tight that door shut? That's important too. A beater is not cool if it's just ragged and clapped out and rattling and leaking. This is the tightest 50s car I've ever been in. And I'm telling you, I've been in some million dollar street rides. This works better. Check this out. Fires right up, just like a brand new Challenger. Let's do this. <laughs> Behind the wheel is where it all comes together for this car and why we really think it's the greatest. Because it is just tight. I mean, it's got vent windows as all cars should, the requisite enormous steering wheel as all cars should, the perfect windowsill height, the bench seat for the over the shoulder action. This thing cruises. Other thing I love about it is that I don't care what corner you're going around or what bump you're hitting, the tires on this car do not rub. That is enormous for me and it doesn't overheat either. That is a huge pet peeve. A beater daily driver cannot overheat. It makes the car just junk no matter what else is good about it. And not only the tires don't rub, but the thing rides great. I won't say that it's the best handling car ever, but it doesn't need to be. I don't want this thing to be a corner carver. I want it to cruise down the highway and over the streets and just be comfy and plush. And it is. They all drive Priuses. They do not get it. These original air conditioning controls, they actually function for the vintage air unit and the air conditioning works great. This original gauge unit, every one of the instruments works because they've been redone by Redline Gauge Works up in Santa Clarita, California. It's just the perfect combination of vintage with modern function. And you know what? It moves out pretty good too. It's got four and a quarter horse from that SRT8 6.1 liter Hemi, the same engine you'd see in a new Challenger. So can you tell we love it? This thing was built by Jonathan Ward and his guys at Icon 4x4 in Van Nuys, California. We need to know if you can do better. If you think that you've got a better beater than the derelict here, you need to post it at facebook.com forward slash hot rod mag. That is our page. You're gonna put your picture up. You're gonna tell us what makes your car great. We're gonna hear what other people have to say about it. And the one car that we like best by March 15th, 2011, we are gonna pick, we're gonna fly to you, and we're gonna feature it in Hot Rod Magazine. 
So that's the plan. Show us your best beater. No race cars, no show cars, no pro touring cars. Beaters, tighter and better than this one. Get on it.